do subscribe to Ikeda channel and press bell icon to get updates about latest engineering, HSC and IIT JE main and advanced videos. Uh, hello students, we have already seen the theory part of Venturi meter and Orifice meter. So today we will be looking at the numericals and different varieties in it. So let me read out the question once again. Uh, 300 mm by 200 mm venturi meter is vertically placed carrying water in the upward direction. A differential mercury manometer is connected to the inlet in the throat of the venturi which gives a reading of 20 centimeters. So we have to find the discharge and the value of coefficient of discharge you have to assume at 0 0.98. So it's a question similar to the question 1 that we have solved earlier. Here the only thing is you have to calculate discharge. Earlier we had to calculate the value of the reading, the mercury reading. So first of all you have to calculate both the areas and once you get the area so go to the formula and substitute the values and get the answer of the value discharge. So we've got the value of A1, A2, we've got the value of H also. Now let's use the formula for discharge and substitute all the values. So after substituting the values of A1, A2 and H and calculating we get the value of discharge as 0.243 meter cube per second. So that's the answer. Um, since the value of coefficient of discharge is given here, we need to find the actual discharge which is the theoretical discharge multiplied by the coefficient of the discharge value. So the value of discharge that you get through the formula is the actual discharge and the theoretical discharge is when you multiply it with the coefficient of discharge which is given as 0 0.98. So after you multiply the theoretical value with the value of CD, you get the actual discharge. So which is 0 0.240 meter cube per second. So that was all about this question.